Hey Google, play Send Me Radio. Here's a Spotify station based on your playlist Send Me Radio. Hey Google, play Send Me Radio. Okay, here's your Spotify playlist called Send Me Radio. Welcome to Mountain Top Prayer 150 Days of Psalms on Send Me Radio with Pastor Chidi Ockery. Call in on 5163878860 or ask Alexa for Send Me Radio on Spotify, Google and Apple Podcast, iTunes, iHeartRadio, Roku on all major streaming platforms or on the Send Me Radio app. Visit us on the web at www.hesendme.com Email us at digitalinityesendme.com Like and share with friends and family and subscribe to Send Me Radio everywhere. Welcome to Send Me Radio. We promote the gospel. Download our free app, Send Me Radio, from the Google Play Store. Visit our website at www.hesendme.com to subscribe and contact us. Like and share us everywhere. God bless you listeners and welcome to the prayer line. We're broadcasted live here on Facebook and Twitter. You can just join us. You can call in or you can watch our live stream, which is taking place right now on social media. And also remember, you can download our app. It can be found on the iTunes store and also on Google Play. Just search for us under Send Me Radio. Once again, you are live to the prayer line with Pastor Chidi. Oh, Corey. Pastor Chidi. God bless you, listeners. We thank God for your life. We give God praise for another week. Thank you for your support and prayers. And we continue to give God glory because of the grace he has showered upon us and upon you who constantly pray for this ministry we want to thank you and we want to appreciate you all that come every week you make out your time every week to pray with us we want to appreciate god in your life we always uh we also want to thank you for the blessings that you have been showering upon us we want to thank you and want to encourage you to continue for the lord who owns the field and the vineyard will pay you accordingly at his own time this evening i want to pray and i want to encourage us to be attentive and to be very sober as we go into the presence of God. So I want you to please, whatever you're doing, you can put it on hold for these few minutes that we're going to stay together. It's just about 60 minutes out of your time and we dedicate it to God. So I want you to just pay attention. God bless you. Before we start, let's just pray. Father, we thank you this moment. We give you glory. We thank you, O oh God, this evening because you have um, been with us. You have protected us. You have guided us throughout the day up till this moment. You did not allow us to encounter any danger. You did not allow us to be vulnerable to any of the plans and gimmicks of the wicked one. We want to ask you, Lord, to come and be with us as we intercede and hear the word of God. Lord, because it is your will that we know who you are, that we understand the scripture. He said, men err, men make mistakes because we don't know you and we don't know the scripture. We don't know the power of God and we don't know the scripture. Lord, we ask you to open our eyes of understanding this moment that we may know the scripture, that we may understand your word, that we may know what you want us to do and how you want us to lead our lives. We thank you, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Amen. Today, I want you to just open your scripture, open your Bible to the book of Psalms chapter 37. We're going to start from there. Psalms, the book of Psalms. I'm going to be reading from verse 1 as we go through it. The Bible said, Never envy the wicked, the wicked. Soon they fade away like grass and disappear. Trust in the Lord instead. Be kind and good to others. Then you will be safely here in the land and prosper 
living in safety. If you're lighted with the Lord, then He will give you all the heart's desire. Commit everything you do to the Lord. Trust Him to help you do it. And He will. Your innocence will be clear to everyone. He will vindicate you with the blazing light of justice shining down as from the new day. Rest in the Lord. Wait patiently for Him to act. Don't be envious of evil men who prosper. Verse 8. Stop your anger. Turn off your wrath. Turn off your wrath. Don't fret and worry. It only leads to harm. Praise God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The Bible is explaining to us in this particular verse that we should trust the Lord. Trust. He said, trust the Lord. Be kind and do good. King James Version say, trust the Lord and do good. It means that all your good deeds or all your benevolence, the things that you do to others,